女士们、先生们，下面有请奥迪股份公司。Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage Professor Robert Stadler. 欢迎各位来宾，各位先生们，下面有请奥迪股份公司。Ladies and gentlemen，先生们，下面有请奥迪股份公司。Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Since 2014, the first premium compact sedan has been another symbol of our successful Chin
the product, the model with a comprehensive enha enhancement offers Chinese customers a new and more personalized pr product ex ex um, uh, experience. All uh, the price of the new Audi would be um, uh, the price range will be uh, 188,000 to 399,000 RMB. During a year of focus, you will also see FAW Volkswagen actively promoting the projects which have been identified in a 10-year business plan, including joint uh, R&D um, plans. The Audi um, X17 to be unveiled next will provide a reference production uh, of NEV models in the future. In a moment, our German partners will share with you with the forward-looking concepts of this model. We eye on the present, but also focus on the future. In the future, FAW Volkswagen will continue to leverage more forward-looking innovations, better product portfolio, and more premium services to deliver future-oriented auto life um, for customers. Thank you very much. on the ceiling It's like a sparkle in my eyes Like the sun in the universe I can feel the vibes I'm charged with excitement You are the light In my life Shine so bright Sportback concept. Brand new Audi e transport bag defines the next uh, stage of um, automotive development. It shows the Audi's um, concept for future mobility. Please welcome to the stage Mr. Mark Fichter. <laughs> wow. Ladies and gentlemen, the Audi e-tron Sportback concept. Um, it's electrifying, it's absolutely emotional, and it's technology-driven masterpiece. With a power of 370 kilowatt and a range of more than 500 kilometers, it's our blueprint for our future electric battery electric vehicles at Audi. And I'm very proud to tell you already today that this is more than a show car. As a second e-tron derivative, we will launch the Sportback in 2019 on the market. The body style is a new interpretation of a Gran Turismo in a forward-looking manner. Simply, we put the Audi S7 roof on an SUV body. The result is an elevated coupe with significant quattro architecture. Please imagine the Audi e-tron on the road. From a big distance, you recognize that this is an e-tron because of the inverted single frame which is placed in the dark surrounding. The side view 
is very powerful because of the very fast and sleek roof line, which is sitting on a very strong body with a very powerful muscle on the top of the rear and the front wheel. And this emphasizes quattro. This is my favorite perspective, the rear end. It's a highlight. The narrow cabin is sitting on a really wide body. It's underlined by an LED light band. And honestly, for me, this is super sexy. Ladies and gentlemen, we would not be Audi not giving our latest technology a striking expression. Our light solutions are, in fact, I underline this fact in a stunning way. The LED matrix light units are able to communicate with us by projecting lights on the road. In the interior, illuminated surfaces are creating a fourth dimension inside the car, like the virtual cockpit, the fully integrated displays in the architecture of the dashboard. Ladies and gentlemen, to be honest, I'm really looking forward to see the Audi e-tron Sportback driving on the road. And now I'd like to say thank you and like to hand over to my colleague Dietmar Fockenreiter. 下面有请奥迪股份公司市场销售董事 Please welcome to the stage uh, Dr. Vorgenreiter to the stage. The technical features of this car are also super cool. The e-tron Sportback is really amazing. It has as Mark said, 320 kilowatts, and even in the boost function, more than 370 kilowatts. With one electric engine at the front and two electric engine at the back, it's realized a real quattro all-wheel drive. I'm really happy to see this car in 2019 already on the road, because this car is close to the serial production car. Already by the end of next year, its brother will go into the production, the Audi e-tron as an SUV. It will be a battery electric SUV and the first electric car in our core competition with an everyday usability. It has a range of more than 500 kilometers, a unique driving experience and a great design. In 2020, ladies and gentlemen, we will offer the third premium electric car in the compact car segment. And starting in 2021, we will electrify one Audi model in each of our existing car series. Here in China, ladies and gentlemen, we will offer locally produced e-tron models in cooperation with our partner FAW Volkswagen. Plug-in hybrid as well as fully electric cars. And now it's time to hand over to our colleagues from Audi Sport, Stefan Winkelmann. It's your stage. Thank you. Sport. Exciting design and um, electrifying uh, drives. Please welcome to the stage the mod model world of Audi, um, Audi Sport. Ladies and gentlemen, good morning and welcome to Audi Sport here in Shanghai. The next couple of years will be interesting and exciting at the same time. Because we are going to launch 20, uh, in the next 24 months, eight new models. The models, so the R8 and the RS models, are one pillar of our company. The other three are customer racing, Audi Exclusive, which is our individualization program, not only for R8 and RS models, but for the entire Audi lineup. 
And then last but not least, the Audi collection, which is our merchandising department. Last year, we changed the name of our company from Quattro into Audi Sport. And we did it because motorsport is in our DNA. It's part of our roots, starting from the very beginning when uh, the Silver Arrows in the 30s were racing. And then with the successes of the rally in the 70s and in the, in the last two decades with the WEC and the stunning wins in Le Mans. And today with Formula E, the DTM and the R8 GT3. But we are in motorsport not just because we want to win, maybe this is the major reason or the reason number one, but because also we want to showcase that there is a, a transfer of technology from the race to the street legal cars. And today here I would like to show you this with three pairs of cars. And the first pair, so the first couple, which we are going to show you is the R8 and the R8 LMS GT3, please. So, ladies and gentlemen, um, can you imagine that the RS LMS and the GT3 with the street legal cars, they have 50% of common parts? I think that this is really the proof of transfer of technology. And uh, we also have to say that this stunning car, the R8 LMS GT3, is the one who made the difference for us in the customer racing department in 2016 because for us it was the best year ever. We won 24 championships, we had 85 single wins and more than 100 um, additional podium places. And here in Asia, on top of that, we have a cup. So we have a one make race series which is based exactly on this car. And this is one of the cars which is racing here in Asia. And this is very successful since the year 2012. So now it's starting the fifth season. The next couple I'm going to present you is the RS3 and the RS3 LMS. So ladies and gentlemen, one month ago in the Middle East we presented the street legal version, both Sportback and Sedan, and uh, the feedback was stunning. We had an immediate success. And this car here, the RS3 LMS, is and was already successful on the racetracks around the world before the street legal car is going to hit the market. So it's another proof of this transfer of technology. And now we have the third couple. We have the RS5 DTM and the RS5 Coupe.
So this time we don't have the race car, we have the street legal car, the RS5 Coupe. Why? Because this is the Asia premiere of this car. For us, this is the perfect combination of luxury, high performance and outstanding design. So for us, this is really a Gran Turismo at its best. Or in other words, it's an athlete in a tailor-made suit. This car has a 2.9 TFSI B-Turbo engine. It's a V6 engine with 450 horsepower. It has 600 newt meter of torque, so 170 more than the predecessor. And uh, this together with the Quattro all-wheel drive system is jump-starting the car from 0 to 100 in just 3.9 seconds. And uh, the top speed of the car is 280 kilometers an hour. And we also achieved to reduce the CO2 emissions by almost 20%. I think by showing these three couples or these three pair of cars, uh, our motto is underlined, born on the track, built for the road. Thank you very much and enjoy the show. Grazie. 女士们、先生们，非常感谢您出席奥迪股份公司及奥迪运动有限公司的。News release and the Audi Sport news release. Now we invite you all to the stage to take up, to take pictures with our new models. Thank you very much for attending the Audi AG and Audi Sport press conferences. We now invite you to take photos and discover our new models. Thank you very much.